What's good? And today we got a Madden Mobile 21 4th of July promo concept made by Pip. Guys, make sure you check his channel out. It'll be in the link in the description and as well the pin comment down below. Go ahead and subscribe to him. He makes really good card art and he made this whole entire 4th of July promo concept. So a huge shout out to Pip, man. Check out his channel right now. Go do that. And before we get into the video, make sure you drop a like down below. Let's see if we can get 100 likes on this promo concept. Also, rate when this video is over. Once you've seen all the card arts and the whole promo concept, basically. Rate it down below out of 10 and give my man Pip some credit. So, yeah. Let's not waste any time and get right into this. So, our first card is a Jordan Howard. Now, I have all of the cards pulled up on my computer right now. And I'm just going to give like a better look into them. To be honest because they're looking pretty nice all of the cars have the same kind of background concept which is great you got the american flag the statue of liberty and fireworks and confetti that's what you need you know which look and the and the uh, bald eagle i guess you can say right back there too looking pretty nice jordan howard looking great as well he has a plus two speed to fourth of july players that is great 250 power everything's placed well everything looks nice the border under his name is looking nice as well um that kind of color that border color it looks kind of white on yeah it doesn't look white well kind of it kind of looks white but when i'm looking at it, it kind of looks tan uh it gives like a like a, a dirty kind of look to the card um something like that you got like the red outlines for like the flag because it has like red uh stripes on it also like the blue like little border with the stars that's laid out on all of the cards. It's all looking pretty nice. You got Jordan in blue and Howard in red. Same thing for all the cards. They're looking nice. And you got the 4th of July logo too. Pretty crisp, pretty nice. Well, that was Jordan Howard, to be honest. Just by looking at this first card, I'm going to give it a, you know, 9 out of 10. Okay, I'm, I'm going to give the 9 out of 10 for all of the card arts because they have the same kind of thing. The only thing that changes is the player and their name and their you know boost okay the plus two that they give that's it but still it is really solid i'm liking it i'm liking the theme all the details all the work that was put into it so yeah nine out of ten on the card art now for the news tab the promo concept that i'm gonna rate that when i get to that and make sure you guys stay tuned for that towards the end of the video the next card we got is fletcher cox to be honest a great image of him right here i'm, I'm liking this one i'm re i really am um fletcher cox is a great player he gets plus two tackle to fourth of july players you got fletcher and blue and cox in red looking pretty nice uh to be honest yep I i'm really liking the theme Let's zoom in for you guys right there yeah liking that next card we got is eric whittle with plus two zone to fourth of july players and a great image of him too in black if he was in white he really wouldn't be spotted out it would be more like he will be blended into the back of the card you know it the black spots him out perfectly though i'm liking the jersey though I, I love the black ravens jerseys they look sick on them also the the purple ones those are nice and the last and final card i saved the best for last tyree kill the cheetah himself the fast you know fastest uh, could we say fastest player in the nfl he i don't know if he i don't know he's like the top fastest players in the nfl right now but Still, he gives plus two catch to 4th of July players. If he gave plus two speed, I think that would be unfair. So, plus two catch, not bad. Um, you got his image, red, making him pop out a little bit more in the card. You got Tyreek in blue and Hill in red. Pretty nice. Also, the script font is a little addition and makes it kind of look nice. Um, you know, the whole theme of 4th of July. It's all looking great. As I said, 9 out of 10 with the card art. And last but not least, we got... The news tab this news tab i'm 100 percent i i like this i'm i'm liking this news tab a lot i got it pulled up right here where i can see where i can read it all and i'll show you guys it in three two one there we go the fourth of july promo news tab honestly looks pretty nice i'm liking the background where you got the american flag and you got a little bit confetti too on there you got um right under eric whittle you got like a uh, like a little player right there let me zoom in for you guys right there a little player you got two flags down there a little fireworks and then you got the statue of liberty also like the big image in the background 
which is looking pretty nice. And if you look on the sides, this is like an actual like background though. Like the actual background, if you went onto the game, there will be the news tab. You click continue and you can see behind it, there is like, you know, stars of the American flags and fireworks at flag and black right there. You can see the solo and store on the bottom. That's a great addition to make it look even better. You even got the three lines up there. Uh, can I zoom into that? Three lines up there. You also got the logo, a little like flag too. A lot of detail went into this news tab and this whole entire promo. Honestly, looking pretty nice. I'm liking the concept. We are going to get the 4th of July promo in Madden Mobile 21 pretty soon because we are moving on to 4th of July soon. So that should be the next promo into Madden Mobile um, that we are going to get. So keep that in mind. Uh, but yeah, four cards looking sick. I rate them a 9 out of 10. The news tab, to be honest, I'm going to give it, with all the details, a uh, 9.5 out of 10. Um, and if we put it all together, it's honestly a 10 out of 10. A lot of work, a lot of um, just details went into all of this stuff. The 4th of July little concept right here. It also says, 4th of July is here. Start off your 4th with collecting fireworks to build a 102 overall master. Also collect brand new 99 and 101 overall players, plus white, red, and blue fireworks. Come back each day at 10.30 a.m. Eastern to claim new first win rewards on events. Something EA would actually say and put in there. Really, a lot of detail went into this. Uh, guys, go right now and in the first link in the description and the pinned comment down below, subscribe to Pip, man. Honestly, an incredible job. Um, if I did this, it would have took me hours. I really don't know how long he took on it, but he did send it to me quite fast. So I'm guessing he was probably already working on this or it probably took him an hour or two. Honestly, incredible for the amount of time he spent on it. He is one of the, as you can say, kind of top, you know, people who make art in the community um i think he was getting into it or something like that but still an amazing job there's a lot of other people who uh make you know pretty decent art too in the community if you guys feel if you could make some similar art like i just showed you that pip has made go ahead and comment down below or dm me on you know instagram or discord and just shout it out to me and i'll feature you in a little video like this and you know I'll go over your concept that you have made, but I reached out to him because, you know, 4th of July is coming up. He said he was down to make it and he did. He, he delivered. So thank you so much, Pip. I hope you guys did enjoy this one. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.